A sprawling eyesore is going to be knocked down in Harrison Township after eight years of just sitting there vacant. Kelly Mays here with the story new this hour. Kelly? Well, Jack, we've learned tonight the old Dayton Executive Inn will be demolished next week, and people we talked to in the area today are glad to see it go. You could just see the water. Oh, man. Inside, it looks like a dump. Outside, not much better, but on February 18th, the old Dayton Executive Inn will finally be torn down. When you have a lot of abandoned buildings, um, you get a lot of unsavory people in those buildings. The hotel closed in 2007. This YouTube video shows just how much of a mess it's become. Even so, Dick Bell can remember the Dayton Executive Inn in its heyday. It was a lot of fun. A lot of people were up there. But it's just worn out. It's, it's welcome. It's an eyesore. And apparently nobody's paid taxes on it. So we're all paying for it. So let's get it down, get something else, and then it's worth it. Harrison Township officials say the building's owners were millions of dollars behind on taxes. So the township took ownership. And with this new casino or, and uh, racetrack here, it's got to be an improvement. Just tear it down, put something else in there that's needed here in the north part of town. The new Racino just down the street from the Dayton Executive Inn forced all eyes to Harrison Township when it opened in August and brought renewed energy to the area. I guess the city is beginning to care. It'll give them hope that maybe some new businesses will come in to, you know, bring some jobs and revenue to the community. Maybe retail or something that the community will want to uh, go to, like Sing 75. Maybe a Radisson, maybe uh, something like that. Put something in there that helps, helps the neighborhood out. Get rid of the blight. Now, Harrison Township officials are going to speak on Demolition Day next Wednesday. No word just yet on their plans for that space once it's gone, so stay tuned. Jack